with another episode of As the Beer Swirls. My name is Dan. And my name is Mike. Dan, what are we drinking? Mike, we're representing the FLX. Right? FLX. For those of you that don't know real quick, FLX, Finger Lakes, short, acronym. It's a thing. Uh, this is. is from the Peacemaker Brewing Company Ooh, Peacemaker. Cut in Canandaigua, New York. Indeed. Representing just the heart of the Finger Lakes. Heart of the Finger Lakes. Uh, this is their interstate Hazy IPA brewed with Strata and Idaho 7 yes. hops. Idaho so, 7, mother sucker. Pretty cool label. Coming in at 5.7 ABV, canned on 12, 15, 21, because they stamp it on there because they know what the hell they're doing. They're good people. Um, good people. Otherwise, it'd be just a blue dot. Yeah, that'd be no good. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Peacemaker. Haven't had much from them. Uh, it's it's so, so weird. It's a nice local joint. Um, they took over a, a local building down here, and they have made it so pleasant. They got a great outdoor seating uh, arrangement. Real here. quick, it says the uh, artwork by Sadie Mays Art and Design. So I don't know, is, but well done. Yeah. It's a great label. Uh, I yeah. <laughs> the sad thing is, it's like I never get a lot of their IPAs when I go there because I always drink their Scotch Ale because <laughs> it's freaking delicious. Um, so I'm kind of excited to try this. I like Strata. I like Idaho Seven. Um, I think Idaho 7 is kind of an unsung hop. Yeah, I'm, I'm down with some Strata, too. Um, um, yeah, so... I don't know. It, it, I'm at a loss for words because I, I, I want to apologize to local breweries because I, I guess I always pass by their stuff, right? It's a shame. Like, I only drink <laughs> beer when I'm at the brewery. But you get you get that mindset of, like, oh, I can just go to the brewery and get this. Yeah. What can I get? Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 It, it, it That's sucks. unfortunate. Uh, and it, it doesn't help that our area is just Ooh, stupid with we'll breweries. Get some floaties. So. Oh, you got a little floaties. Oh, yeah. Oh, Literally. look at all those floaties. It's like it's like beer glitter. Uh, it's, it is. I was going to say Sea of Stars, but I like beer glitter better. <laughs> Hashtag beer glitter. Ooh. Um, right. it's, it's a marmalade-like. This is more of a, like... Not West, well, it's a, yeah, it's an orange marmalade, it's West orange Coasty. Marmalade. I like it. Man, yeah, no, it's hazy. It's hazy. It's, oh, yeah, well, it's super hazy. I mean, it when I, first, it when I first poured it, I think you had to shake it up a little of it. Yeah. Because it was a bit clearer when I first poured yeah. it. Yeah. Um, but Tight, yeah, it looks Compact straight. bubbles, little, just a half, barely a half finger ahead. Yeah. It looks like a nice West Coasty IPA. Uh, let's get a whiff. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. What is that? That's pineapple. Pineapple. There's some melon in there. All backed by like there's a there's a green. Oh, I swirled it up. I got more. Oh, man, there's a green. Bit like, of a fruit, dang. fruity, like fruit roll up. There's a. It's like a like yeah. A it's berry, kind of like, candy. Not berry, like but a like, candied like a passion fruit? fruit. There's passion fruit. I'm getting some passion fruit. Yeah, it definitely smells like red berry ish. I got a weird. It smells like red berry, like dank. <laughs> what's going? On? What's going on? They they already know. Okay, I I I I, I was getting a whiff and I accidentally got us. We're gonna dive right in. All right, I'm sorry. Secret sips. sips. Mm. Mm. Okay. Ooh. That's uh that's tart. Not tart, but it's it's a, it has the tart aspect, a, a but tart, it's fruity. There's some funk on the end. Dude. <laughs> right. Like what I got in the nose, that dank funky aspect, is just bit of strawberry. Popping. It's bitter as hell. Bit of strawberry? Like a candied strawberry like on the shortcake. Your strawberries and shortcake. Like the angel cake, and you, you mix okay. your sugar and your strawberries. I'm getting the strawberry like leaves. Mm. Dude, I I went back for a sip, but I had to stop myself because I'm still working on that sip. Okay, it's there. It's there to stay. It's this, moving in. The bittering aspect just hangs around, like that earthy bitter I'm okay dirt. With that. I'm okay. I with love. I'm 100. percent Like I freaking really like it a lot. They all can't be all juice and just nothing else. There's um, a nice complexity to it, I, th I think it adds. I know the, the reason when I picked this can up, mm -hmm. uh, it was specifically because of the Strata and Idaho 7 hops, because I was like, oh, there's a good combination that we don't get a lot of hazy IPAs from, and I'm very pleased with my selection. 
Um, I think this is a mixture, man, of like a traditional American IPA, like the the bitterness that yep. lends. Uh, there's a slight malty, uh, the grain, Just slight, a slight touch. grainy yeah. cracker uh, malt bill to it. I'm getting there's a there, there's a sweetness, but I think it kind of it, it kind of bounces around. Oh no, the sweetness is there. The See, sweet, it's not for me. It's not as overpowering. Like no, the but the bittering is for just, me. The sweetness and the fruit right are coming at you, and here's like the bitterness and that that drying aspect, mm-hmm. and they're battling like those robots from a like, Hugh Jackman just like flop of a movie. What was that called? I can't believe you didn't pick BattleBots. You went from a Hugh Jackman flop. <laughs> I mean, you know, not even, not even the like old like board game where like you went for a Hugh Jackman. That's what popped in my head. Shit movie. What was it called? Yeah, I think it was BattleBots. I don't fucking <laughs> know. Wait a minute. Who knows? It doesn't matter. <laughs> but I, the point is. This will be your so your next label, make a special edition with Hugh Jackman. <laughs> Hugh cover. Jackman special edition. <laughs> oh my gosh. But I mean you make a good point. Like there there are definitely flavors. The bittering aspect it's, is such a, a, a backbone of this, but the the sweet, uh you've got some fruit in there, and it's all just kind of battling for what you taste next. It's so in, fruity. In sip. It's like, so fruity. Vine fruit, man. I'm strawberry, strawberry passion fruit, pineapple. berries, like all that vine fruit is is in there with the vine and the leaves. Man, this is nice. It's it, almost Michael never show. He's a little camera shy when it comes to this, but he's got like the Tupac tattoo. It says the vine life. You'll never it's see that thug, thug life. Right above my belly. Yeah, never see it. I, you're going back, right? Because you're gonna get Vinius across the chest. It, it's eventually gonna be like it, people get sleeves. I'm going to get shirts. You get, like, prison yard tattoos of just, like, vines and vineyards. Oh, absolutely. Awesome. It's going to be great. So, eventually, if you guys stick around long enough, I'm going to do a review shirtless. (laughs) It's going to be pretty awful. (laughs) We'll put CGI Hugh Jackman head on. (laughs) You can be a freaking battle bot. (laughs) Just constantly just like... All right, uh, no, this is good beer. Um, I really like this beer. It a makes lot. me want to go buy Peacemaker now. <laughs> yeah, I mean they make they make solid yeah. beer. Uh, yeah, so what are you giving it? Uh, hey, I'll tell you what. Stop thinking about robots. <laughs> Can't do the rating. I'll give this a a three point eight. Ooh, I was gonna give it a three nine. Okay. Okay. We're right. We're right about mm-hmm. there. We're right about there. Solid beer. Solid. From Solid beer. Solid. Um, in the books. In the books. Uh, I don't know why we did that. If you are ever uh, in the Finger Lakes area or hunting out breweries. Canandagua. We are stupid. Not Canandaga. Not Canandagua. Not Canada. Definitely not. We're close, but it's not Canada. Yeah. If you're in the Canandagua area, you're looking out uh, for FLX beer Hashtag breweries. Hashtag 14424. Peacemaker Brewery is definitely a stop you should make. Yeah, hit them up. Um... As for uh, us, if you're trying to look to talk to us, we've got what? Social medias, FLX Beer Reviews on Instagram, FLX Beer Reviews on Twitter. We have our untaps. We have our email. Everything's linked down below. Check it out. Talk to us. Please. Uh, we like interaction. Go down to Peacemaker. Tell them FLX Beer Reviews sent you. Yeah, uh, do until, that. Until next time. Shit. It's been a hell of a run. Cheers, Cheers guys. Hey, y'all.